She told me she was ready to give in. She told me that she didn't know if she can continue. She was wondering why did she even start? She was feeling very unmotivated. And as she looked at what she had done for the morning, which was, by the way, scroll social media, she was disappointed. She was beating herself up. And this is why I decided to do the series. Welcome to the Confident CEO Journey. I am Julie, and I'm the Confident You person. I am the Casa Confidence host. If you don't know me, you can check out about me, you know, whatever. But here's the thing. I work with many entrepreneurs, and it's not unlikely that you're going to hit a point in which you're not getting any results. And for that reason, many people give up. Many people go and move on to the next thing or decide that they're going to go back to a nine to five, even though they have a big dream and even though they have a big desire to help others. So in this journey, we're going to take over the next 30 days. I want to be able to go through what are the things that are going to make you build your confidence so that as you move in this journey as the CEO of your life and business, you can breathe easily. Why? Because you have the tools that it will take for you to run a business that brings in the income that helps you pay your bills. Run a business that allows you to then have the freedom and flexibility to maybe read a book for the afternoon or be able to invest or pay for something that maybe a family member needs. Maybe you're looking to do a renovation in your home, or maybe you want your husband to not be disappointed that you are not bringing in income to the family. Whatever the reason may be, a lot of things happen in this world to us in our lives that knock out our confidence. So let's talk about confidence. Confidence is key for entrepreneurs. Why? Because when we feel like crap, when we feel like we don't have what it takes, we're not going to keep going. We're going to give up. I'm going to tell you, confidence for me is at the intersection of bravery and bravery and action, right? That's what confidence is. When we don't have the evidence that we've done something, we're not going to feel like, oh, I got it. I do it. I know how. We're going to be apprehensive. We're going to stay in the sidelines and we're not going to take action. And then all of a sudden life is going to pass you by. So this is why confidence is key for your confidence CEO journey. And I'm going to be talking a lot about this, but also giving you some tangibles of the things that you need to do in your business to make it successful. Now, how is Sirius going to empower you and your business? Well, easy. It's about community. It's about knowing the different steps because sometimes, you know what, we have to follow a recipe. I'm going to tell you yesterday I made um, pizza, but not in the regular way. I made a cottage cheese pizza dough. I never made it. I just saw the recipe on TikTok and I decided I'm going to try it. And did it taste like pizza? Not really. Did it look like pizza? Not a hundred percent, but basically I had all of the ingredients and now I can perfect the recipe as I go along. And this is what I'm hoping to do for the individuals tuning into the series. Look at the different ingredients and let's put together the recipe. And if it's not great the first time, my friend, like me, you practiced and then you keep refining it. You keep looking at where maybe you went wrong and then you can start to create the business that you desire, the one that makes an impact, the one that allows you to not worry about how much money you have in the bank. Do you have enough money to go on that trip or to buy your kids the back to school clothes that they want? So let's talk about some of the topics that we're going to be covering in the series. We're going to be covering about mastering your mindset. We're going to talk about building a vision because with that vision, we're nothing. Honestly, the first day that I launched my business after getting laid off, I laid in bed that night and I created my vision for my business. I created a mission and that drives me. Has it been driving you? Do you have a vision that drives you? So again, we're going to talk about how to create one, how to live one, how to 
craft one, refine it and all of that. We're also going to be talking about personal brand. We're going to talk about how to get clients. What is the client attraction that works? Leveraging speaking engagements and podcasts. I have a podcast and let me tell you, my business has grown because of it. And I am a firm believer that you will build a business because of your authority, because of your business. We're also going to be talking about financial mastery. What are the components that you need to run a business successfully when it comes to finances? We're going to be talking about the power of content marketing. I love marketing, by the way. If you're not marketing in the right way, you're going to be spinning your wheels and you're going to be exhausted. So we'll talk about that. Crafting your unique offers, offers that sell. We're going to talk about community. We're going to talk about productivity. We're going to talk about, again, habits, which is another thing that I love. So stay tuned for this series. It's going to be quick, down and dirty, things that will help you. And this is going to be happening throughout the next 30 days. So don't miss an episode. Click subscribe and make sure that you share this with a person that you know will benefit from hearing about this. And my friend, don't forget, see you tomorrow and go confidently in the direction of your dreams. Episode one in the books.